The scale of the development varies from park to park, but they're looking at adding golf courses, pickleball courts, and large hotels to parks across Florida, but it has created a lot of controversy just in these first few days. The Sunshine State has more than 800,000 acres of land within its state parks with 2.3 million visitors each year, including Honeymoon Island and Hillsborough River State Park in Tampa Bay. We have beautiful state parks. It is what really adds to the diversity of our state, not only for our visitors that come from all over the world, but also our residents. Under the governor's proposal, nine parks in Florida would undergo major developments, including 18 whole golf courses, pickleball courts, and 350 rooms park lodges. Plans for the state parks in Tampa Bay call for four pickleball courts at each park and a disc golf course. It's getting pushback from local groups. We just feel really strong that don't fix it if it's not broken and that the state owns a lot of land in the state of Florida that they could use to do something like that with that's not a state park. It's impossible not to disrupt the wildlife, the birds, you know, all of the things that, that each park has. Republican Senators Rick Scott and Marco Rubio have come out against the proposal, along with other state officials from both parties. Representative Kathy Castor from Tampa Bay said, Florida natural spaces are unique and special, and I adamantly oppose Governor DeSantis's radical plan to literally pave paradise and put up a pickleball court. Florida's unique natural lands and habitats, our state's identity and way of life, should not be bulldozed to cut developers a cheap deal. But the Department of Environmental Protection says the plans only hope to expand public access to parks, increase outdoor activities, and provide more lodging options to accommodate tourists in these destinations. Because of public interest in the plans, the Florida Department of Environmental Protection had meetings scheduled for this week, but they're expecting bigger crowds. Now they're going to reschedule for the week of September 2nd. In Hillsborough County, Evan Moon, Fox 13 News.